wrinkle. Now there's a lot of different ways to identify this word wrinkle. This in the book, it's, it says wrinkle her nose and say, what's in there anyway? So let's try wrinkling our nose like this boy. And do you think wrinkling your nose is something positive or something ne negative? Negative. Yeah, it gives us um, a different, uh, an idea that's not, um, it's a reaction that's not very nice, right? Not very kind. Like, remember in the book how um, the girl who was eating her rice and kimchi, the, her friend was wrinkling her nose? She, I guess she didn't like the smell. And she, and she made it obvious. All right. Wonder, what is this boy doing? Hmm. Do it with me. Thank I want you. to see everybody wondering. Wonder. We see one, we see this word wonder in our very own books, right? Our wonders books, our red books. What's the name of those books, Wonders? That means something when you're imagining or thinking, you're just, hmm, you're thinking very deeply, wonder. And then in the book, it says, you'll wonder why she doesn't remember. Fall in. What is this kitty doing? He fell down. It fell. Yeah, it did literally fall, but it also have, has fallen asleep, right? Fallen asleep. That's, that's the way the book is using it. Uh, you can only remember the books you kept on reading long after she had fallen to sleep. Mm -hmm. Now this, new, this word right here, lifted. What does lifted mean? What do you think? Yeah, use your words. I'm lifting my pen. Do you think there's another word for lift? To lift? What about pick? Pick up? It's pretty much the same thing. It's picked up, lifted up, those are synonyms. And like this baby's being lifted as it lifted off the curb in the book. Okay. Wade. Wade. What do you what do you think this picture is showing for Wade? Weather. Weather. A oh, weather. It says heat wave. So it's something uh, uh, like a wave of like a heat wave. Like the way the book is talking about it is where it says, you can only remember how the heat waves. It's when something just happens intensely, right? There's like an intense, an intense heat wave. It's like, like something overpowering, right? When like, for example, in our summers here, when our heat does wave, because all of a sudden it becomes like in the 90 degrees for a whole week, right? That's a heat wave. But waves can also mean, hello, a greeting, right? Good. Okay. Untraveled, what do you think untraveled means? In the book it says, they look like they'll turn to dust in your own untraveled hands. And Angelina was talking about when she held those seashells that were souvenirs, she felt like they were gonna turn into dust in her own untraveled hands because they were fragile, remember? But what is untraveled hands? She's, she's describing her hands, but at the same time, Tra untraveled is a verb, right? It's an action. Untraveling, does anyone know what that might mean? 
because 